I'm surprised there's no hanging fish because I've seen that, but it doesn't matter. Now we could now copy all of those and duplicate it. I mean, select all those and duplicate them. Now what about the rope? And now let's make a look now everything selected and now let's just duplicate it I have a mouse problem sometimes it just stops so I'm going to be doing a I think three of these should be enough Let's just take a look at this. If it's good or not, it's a little bit, yeah, a little bit adjustment, and it's it's pretty good. So let's duplicate it once more, and then can be in the middle, but but it's good anyway. So now that's good. We almost have the kitchen, so now what we should do is to take a look at this. I think we're going to put something else here. We need more crates. Let's go just and type crate. I like to use these ones because of these branded sites yeah it's a little bit more desirable so now we need these snap grid and snap tangle things All right that's perfect And just make a bunch of them. And we're good with these. What about these? No. Um, what about the long ones? Yeah. These ones are good too. I'll be using one of these, I think, because the other one couldn't fit. It'll block the way in. So I think one should be enough. Yeah. So. It's nice. Now that we got that nice kitchen, it's all that we need. We got two more stories um, available to do things. So now, I guess the one would be um, living room and the dining room in one, and the one should be a sleeping room or the bedroom. So let's start with with this. Um, go and type in the table. So come on, table two benches. 
What about this? Yeah, this should be good. Two benches, just in case somebody shows up. There has to be some space. Or should be like that. I don't know, but it looks good. But now, if we put it like this, if we rotate it like this, we can we can go all the way to the walls. Just like that. Yeah, it looks good. So now, we need to do um, a few more things to make some details. Now let's go with the plate. think it's under static platter oil it's unavailable so Where is it? The cups. Yeah, I think we should use both of them. Oh, I hate that this happens. It goes under the table. And it should be on the table. And the food. We good. Now I guess we should add something more. Just like that. Add some plates wow <laughs> that's a large one um, basic plates what about this one Or a silver plate. But where is it? Yeah. There's one. They're just more detailed and more beautiful than the, than the basic ones. So we have quite a lot of people can sit here it's six persons so we need to rotate these in order for all the people to have the plates in front of them but again we will need to downsize them And I think now we should disable the snap to grip because it always goes under the table. And we don't need that. Yep. That's cool. 
just duplicate them and make sure they're in front of the people you know turn on the markers if we don't see that so now that we have all the plates arranged properly we need to add some wine Not the empty ones, of course. Let's go with this one. Well, it looks good. Had to make sure we have some varieties, you know, not just the same thing. Hmm. Let's go with the another one. It looks nice. Nice and beautiful. And fourth bottle. Maybe purple. No. no. Some kind of a purple. So now we have a nice dining table. And the food. That's great. What else can we do? these walls I think I think we should add something like this is there a polar bear polar bear this one we're looking for this one a white or a polar bear polar bear Let's make it interesting by adding these things. So now, um, orca. We're going to go with the animals that are native to these regions, you know. The hawkers, the white polar bears, and pretty much um, I don't know, maybe a saber cat. Polar saber cat. Yeah. These ones are native to these regions. So we're going to add those. Just like that. It's really beautiful. And maybe a little thing should be here. And. Could be some kind of drawer. Yeah, this one would do. Just one. Four little things. And now, now let's go with the bedroom. I think this place is good. All right. Let's go with the bed. All right. So. Common bed double. Just in case he finds a woman or he already has one. Or I don't know. But let's let's make that a possibility. Yep, it's cool. 
So um, end table. What about these ones? Oh, I think they're good. So I'm going to be using two end tables to put near the bed. It fits perfectly. So the other one. That fits nice. But the bed doesn't. So now it fits perfectly. Yeah, it's on the floor. So that's a good thing. Next time we need to add a chest for the personal stuff. Yeah. Is there an empty one? No, just don't put the merchant ones. What about this one? I'm going to go with this one. Build your own house, upper chest. And just place it right here. Just in front of the bed. I think it, it's good. It looks great. And now let's make some wardrobes. What about this one? Yeah, it's a good one. It's not a noble house, so it's going to have the common stuff. Yeah. If it's the purpose, that's the most important thing. And now we should put it right about here. Go a little bit towards the wall. Now we have it. Now it's good. We have it all. So the person that's going to live in here would have a crafting stuff, meaning it's going to have a forge, smelter, alchemy, um, enchanter. You know, all from the blacksmith and pretty much it's going to be self-sustainable as long as he hunts the food or buys it, you know. But anyway, he can cook, he can do whatever he wants. So now I noticed a few minor things that I need to fix on the outside. So this mark is good, but on the outside you're going to see now. The outside marker is really poorly fixed. So, as I was in the game, I would enter, I've entered this lighthouse, and when I go outside, <laughs> I would end up behind this wall. So, I couldn't really reach this part. So, now we should just lift it a bit off the ground. Now why does this fades out? I don't know. But anyway, there's a strange effect 
when I go inside the game and when I get outside, the things start to get weird. You know, as this light fades in and out, that's the same thing that happens within the game. Although, in the game, these grey stones turn red, like blood red, and then they come back to the normal. And then, every few seconds, there's a change. I think it has to do something with the height or the coldness, I don't know. But anyway, there's one more thing that I noticed, and that's this part. It's missing the floor underneath. So I'm going to be fixing that. By doing this. I think it's good now. Yeah. That's great now. We fixed all the problems we had. So now that I finished all of those, I, I noticed one more thing, and that's here. As you can see, this part is not really fixed well. So what I should do now is to gently lift this part up. So now it's good. Let's briefly take a look at the other ones to make sure they all fit. Because that's what happens sometimes. Yeah. What about this one? I think this needs to go down a bit. Yeah. It needs, but my mouse is. It's just driving me crazy. Um, I'm going to be adjusting it like that. So, this should do the thing. Now it's good. So now that I have it fixed, I was thinking to do something more. Oh. Right, we have to find a way, yeah. So, I would need to add some stairs. But I'm thinking, where is the best place to put them? All right. Think here. All right, let's go with the stairs. All right. Yeah, these ones should do the trick. So you have these snow ones. Let's take a look how they fit. Well, it's not bad, but it's not great either. I think they should do. They should do the trick. Yeah, pretty much. Just not like that. That fits good. I'm 
And I'll have to adjust more than just these tears. I'm going to be adjusting the landscape as well. So now we have the stairs, which would lead to the lighthouse. Why well, we don't need any more stairs. It's enough. But now, what we need is to adjust the landscape a bit. So let's go with two radius and just raise the land a bit. Yeah. This already looks good. I think it is good. Wow. Looks stunning. That's great. So I have this fixed. Um let's go back to editing. I should save. And now I was thinking to add some kind of a travel um, feature, which would instantly get you to this lighthouse so you don't have to swim or walk on the ice. So let's go with the ship. And take a look what ships do we have. What's this? No, it's not that. Um, ship large. No, we don't need a large ship. We would need something smaller, if possible. But let's take a look at how large this indeed is. Wow. <laughs> it's way too large. And the doors are really, really, really tiny. Now, if I downsize this thing, the doors would be too small for any person to fit in. So I'm not going to do this. Now, let's take a look at these long boats. Long boats are good. And the one thing that's good for us is that it can go through pretty shallow waters. So now that we have that, we just need to take a look at where we could put it. I think we should put it right about here. So let's take a look. How does this look? It looks very nice. So. I'm just going to be putting it right into the water. Yeah, it fits perfectly. So now that we have this, um, I'm going to be adding one. Um, room so it's gonna look like um, this uh, go to static um, what's this it's not gonna be like that we need some kind of a wooden wall um, Not this one. This one could do, but I prefer the wall with a 